so hi this is a bit dirty but it's a workbench what I have in front of me in front of you is I believe this is Symphonisk 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 whatever generation 2 and this is IKEA's version of a Sonos speaker basically it's made by IKEA I think for Sonos or it's made by Sonos for IKEA I'm not quite sure probably the other way around and the idea is to disassemble this speaker I can I actually got a green light to destroy the entire plastics the only thing I need out of this thing is the uh, electronics because you can connect to the LL application and uh, you know stream music whatever and to make it to be able to use this speaker now believe it or not this is actually a scam because everything is 2023 slash 2024 is a scam it's actually not that big speaker because when you uh, yeah but this is actually a ceiling speaker and it is actually a good idea because Sonos speaker that goes into ceiling goes like a thousand euros and the, uh, this version of uh, Sonos Sym Symphonisk, I'm not quite sure how to pronounce it, is actually hundred euros. So I have two of them and I will be only showing you how to disassemble one. I did not disassemble it yet and uh, so you know what, I'm not quite sure what to expect but okay, Symphonisk Symphonisk. Tons of languages. Okay, nothing important. That's actually a quite nice cable. It's uh, I don't know I don't know whether you see it or not, but it's braided, and uh, actually like it. Now, since this thing will be going into ceiling, I will be removing the original speakers that are inside because I'm quite sure that it will you know like lose some weight i think this might be around two meters since yeah i think this is around two meters so yeah okay cool the packaging is uh, quite okay it's there isn't like much plastic which i kind of like okay And by the way, uh, I've already installed these speakers before and they actually sound pretty good. So this is the speaker itself. It's not a small one, but you know, there is like a LAN connector and uh, power. And this thing is used to, you know, to mount them. So if you have like mounts, they like installed like this and you just mount them like this or like this or whatever. Okay. Let's see how to open this thing. Now, since this is IKEA, I think that this thing is most likely uh, disassemblable by removing this thing. Let me see. Do I have something to remove this thing? Can I use this to remove it? Yeah. And here, yeah, there are there are screws inside. Well, at least here. We'll see. Okay. I do wonder how big the magnet inside of this thing is, because this speaker is uh, well heavy. And again, for uh, 100 euros to have like a speaker that's usually a thousand euros, that's a no-brainer. Okay, so I need to open this thing. So eight screws. Okay, can I just pull it? Okay, it might be glued, although it does not seem to be glued. Well, okay, are there any screws in the back? No, 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 no screws. It doesn't seem so. So, I guess I'll just need to pull this thing up. Can I force it? Oh, no. Okay. This thing, I think is, it might be glued, but I don't want to push this thing uh, because I have a feeling that it might have some kind of ribbon or something. So, uh, like this. Okay. Okay. 
yeah it, it has like a sticky tape so uh, okay let's see what's inside it's a cable I'll pull this thing out one okay yeah and there is definitely a cable in here so uh, I don't want to mess the thing up so uh, uh, you know what since I won't be needing these speakers I will be using some kind of snips or something okay so basically this is it and this is a pretty decent looking in the uh, inside I don't know whether you can see it or not but uh, yeah kind of cool so what I will be doing is removing oh by the way <laughs> take a look at the magnet on that speaker <laughs> take a look at the speaker this is impressive and the magnet is very strong so oh, yeah I might be uh, creating a Bluetooth speaker with these four speakers because this thing looks impressive. Okay, basically that is it. So uh, this was a short and sweet video, I guess. It's very easy to disassemble. Yep. If you like this video, please click thumbs up. If you did not, you know what to do. If you have any questions, ask them down below. And that is it.